the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Come back to me with all your heart. Don't let fear keep us apart. Trees to bend, though straight and tall. So must we to others call. For our goodnight message on this Saturday, the 2nd of March, 2024, broadcasting from the Salesian Pontifical University, Rome, Italy, by your servant, Father Eustace Siame, a Salesian of Don Bosco. We listen to this encouraging message in line with the gospel passage of today entitled Lessons from the Prodigal Son Story. Where I will speak integrity and justice with a tenderness. Today we read from Luke chapter 15. The famous story of the prodigal son and I shared in the morning devotion that is more about the prodigal father than the prodigal son. The father who is so caring, who is ready to even come out of himself to make sure we get back to himself. This parable reminds us that no matter how far we have strayed or how deep we have fallen, there is always hope for redemption and restoration. The prodigal son's journey serves as a beautiful depiction of God's unwavering love and his willingness to welcome us back with open arms. Just like the prodigal son, we too may find ourselves lost in our own personal struggles, searching for something more meaningful or feeling disconnected from our purpose. Yet, amidst our wanderings, we must remember that even at our lowest point, grace abounds. The turning point for the prodigal son came when he realized the emptiness of his choices and humbly returned to his father. This act of humility and repentance opened the door to forgiveness and reconciliation. Likewise, No matter what mistakes we have made or how broken we feel, it is never too late to turn back towards God. Throughout this story, we learn that true transformation begins with acknowledging our need for change and seeking guidance from a loving Father who eagerly waits for us to come home. God's love knows no bounds He seeks past our faults and embraces us with compassion and joy. In times of doubt or despair, let us hold on to the lessons from the prodigal son story as a beacon of hope. Remember that no matter how bleak things may seem, there is always an opportunity for renewal and growth. Our Heavenly Father longs to bless us abundantly if only we are willing to return to Him wholeheartedly. May this tale remind you that your past does not define you. It merely serves as a stepping stone towards a brighter future. Embrace the grace that flows freely from God's heart and allow it to empower you as you embark on a journey of healing and restoration in this period of Lent. Take solace in knowing that you are never alone on this path. Lean into your faith, surround yourself with supportive and loving individuals who will encourage you along the way and trust in God's perfect timing. So my dear brother, my dear sister, let us be encouraged by the prodigal son story. May it remind us of our infinite worth and the boundless love that awaits us when we choose to return to our Heavenly Father. You have a purpose and there is a great hope for your future. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. 
The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Good night, as it dreams. Same to you, Father. Come back to me with all your heart. Don't let fear keep us apart. Trees to bend, though straight and tall. So must we to others call. Long have I waited for your coming home to me.